Hello guys, welcome back to Lineup. For today's video, here are going to show you or discuss with you how to fix Steel Series Arctis 9 power button not working. So if you're interested, let's start the tutorial. So if you're having problems with your Steel Series Arctis 9 here and it's not powering on or the power button is not working, there are going to be a few things that you could try here. So first thing that you want to do is you want to ensure that the headset is actually fully charged. So in this case, uh, you want to make sure that your charging cable is actually working properly. Now, if the power button is not working, most likely it's not charging or your head here is not properly charged. So in this case, try using a different cable or even different power source. Now, maybe try char uh, plugging your charger as well directly to the port instead of using like, for example, um, extension cord. So in this case, uh, this usually can solve a lot of the issues. Sometimes the actual extension cord is going to be a problem. But yeah, just try a different cord, a different power source here. And basically look for a solid light or a solid red light when charging. So a weak or blinking red light may indicate the char uh, there are some charging issues here. Now, next thing that you could do here is you might want to hard reset your headset. Sometimes there might be some glitches within the headset itself. Hard resetting it can solve a lot. So first is you want to go and look for the reset button. So in this case, it's going to be near the charging port. So just go ahead and look at it. Now, from then on, you want to use a uh, small paper clip because it's going to be a very small pen hole there. Just press it using a blunt paper clip or any... Uh, pen that you could use for about 20 seconds. Press and hold it for 20 seconds and this should, this should actually initiate the reset process. Now another thing that you might want to do here is you might want to inspect your power button. Now in this case you want to press the power button firmly and ensure it clicks properly. So in this case you should uh, hear or feel that click. Now if the button uh, clicks then the power button does it uh, in this case is not broken. So in this case the button may be physically damaged if you do on not hear or feel any clicks on it. And also another thing that you may, may maybe want to try here is you may want to leave your headset here charge or charging for one or overnight. So in this case, using both the original cable or an, an alternate one, alternative one, you can go and use that ensure the battery receives the full charge. And if none of those actually work, the final last thing that you can do here is basically contact Steel Series support. Now, if the handset still doesn't uh, turn on after trying all the steps that we did before, uh, the power button or tarot battery may be faulty. So you can maybe ask for them to uh, fix this for you or even get or ask for a replacement just in case you bought this on uh, uh, you just got this um, headset here. But in this case, that's about it. Hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to Lenup. Thank you for watching.